everyone! So today we are going to be doing a thrift haul video. I have a few things from the Goodwill Saturday sale and then I do have a few things uh, from when I went to Buffalo Exchange a while ago on my birthday, like a month ago. But I haven't shared them with you yet and they're really great things so I thought I would just throw them in there because I'm sure you guys want to see them. But without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. So I'm going to start with the stuff that I got from Goodwill. So the first thing that I got is this really cool t-shirt that says who died and just has some skeletons on it. I'll probably make this into a halter top or a crop top and I just thought the print was super cute. And this was $1.50. The next thing that I got is a shirt that says End Human Trafficking. Um, again, I'm going to make this into a halter top. Um, I'll probably open up like an Etsy shop with all my halter tops really soon. So I'm pretty excited about that and I'll let you guys know when this is all happening and what's going on and stuff. But I got this shirt for $1.50. And the next shirt that I got is this shirt with King Tut's like full name. I'm pretty sure there's no way I can pronounce this. And it just has some Egyptian symbols. And this again was $1.50. And I don't know if you know this about me, but I've loved Egypt basically since like elementary school. Like when I could read, I would always check books out about Egypt. So this was definitely a great find for $1.50. The next thing that I got is a slip kind of thing, but I'll probably just wear it as everyday wear like I always do. And it is a like bra cup thing, but it goes down really long and it's pretty sheer so I'd have to wear something under it. And it has really cool and cute lace at, down at the bottom. Um, this was really like unique and it fits super super well and it's super cute. And this was only $2.50, so I definitely could not pass it up. And the last two things I got at Goodwill is this lingerie top, and it is so cute. It has really cute, like, detailing, and on the bottom as well, and this was $2.50. And I'm so lucky that I found this. This was hidden within some like long sleeve t-shirts, but I found it. Um, it is actually the matching little uh, cover for the lingerie top and it is literally like the set or whatever. It has the really cool like little detailing on the bottom and really cute detailing on the sleeves and but it does look like it's missing like the little tie but that's not a big deal I have a lot of cute ribbon that I can easily tie around there or just like leave it open and cut them off and this was two dollars and fifty cents as well me and Scott we did go pretty late in the day which is why I didn't get like 500 bags like I usually do um, it was pretty like, it wasn't too picked over, but it was pretty hard to find gems within all the stuff and all the people that were there. But yeah, let's move on to some of the stuff I got at Buffalo Exchange. The first thing that I got are the Jeffrey Campbell and Wild Fox um, ballerina platform shoes. And you've already seen these if you saw my favorites video. But I want to talk about them again because I wanted these shoes for like five plus years and they are in super good condition. They had actually the original sticker on the bottom of the shoe and they are seven and a half and I usually wear like a seven or like a six and a half but these tend to run like pretty small like I tried them on like not expecting them to fit but they fit me amazing 
and I see these online retail for $150 to $250 and I got these for $65 so they were just like a little birthday present to myself. And the next thing that I got is this American Apparel, um, I forget what this print is called, I want to say, I can't pronounce it, if <laughs> it's what I'm thinking of, and it's just a romper, it is a little bit small, I have some major side boob, but I just wear like a really cute bralette with it, and this was only $13.50. The next thing that I got is this really cool glitter knife print pullover like jacket. It's a really light jacket um, and it's actually Andy Warhol brand, like the actual brand. And I thought that was really, really cool. I've never honestly seen any Andy Warhol brand clothing before, so I definitely had to pick this up. And it just fits my goth aesthetic like really, really, really well. And this was only $9. So the next thing that I got is this really cute like fishnet top with some like a chiffon like band around the boob area and it's just li not lined, it has a little thing on the bottom too and on the sleeves. And I thought this would be really cute with like a pair of high-waisted shorts and a really cute bralette. And I believe this was around $9. The next thing that I got is this fluffy cardigan. Does this look gray or does this look like a grayish blue to you guys? Because I like swear that it has like a little bit of blue in it. But my boyfriend swears that it's just like plain gray and I don't know what I'm seeing. And it's just a really nice and warm cardigan and it has pockets which is amazing and they're not like flimsy pockets either. They can actually hold their shit. And I believe this was 50% off or something so it was under $10. The last thing that I got is this Harajuku Lovers purse and it is literally just the cutest thing ever. It looks like it was honestly like never even used and it has like this really cute little ice cream cone keychain and it is a messenger bag and like the inside just has like spots in it. This was super cute. I could not pass this up like who could honestly. For only $15. The last thing that I got is this lip service, it says lip service cult and it is just this really cool high waisted skirt with little buckles on each side and I absolutely love this skirt, I wear it all the time. And I believe this was a little bit more expensive. I think it was around $20. So yeah, that wraps up my thrift haul. So yeah, that wraps up my thrift haul for today. Um, it's a little smaller than usual, so this is going to be a pretty short video. But I still wanted to show you guys all of the stuff that I did get. So if you did enjoy this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys in my next video.